This is question number 39 of IIT Jam Economics 2021 paper. Let's see what the question has to say. If the number of employed worker in a country increases while its population does not change, unemployment rate in the country. First of all, please see this. We have the entire population. Out of the entire population, few people may not opt for working. The people who do not opt for working are out of my labor force. They are not a part of my labor force. The remaining people constitute my labor force. So, this can be my labor force. This is out of labor force. They're not even a part of labor force. Out of the people who are in labor force, they may get a job and may be employed. Or they may not get a job and may be unemployed. So labor force is some of employed and unemployed. Population is labor force and out of labor force. Now see the question. The number of people employed, if the number of people who are employed increases. So what is increasing is this. People who are employed has increased. While population does not change. Population is not changing. Population is constant. Then. Unemployment rate in the country. What is unemployment rate? Unemployment rate is, so unemployment rate is number of people who are unemployed divided by the labor force. I can also rewrite this as the number of people who are unemployed is number of people in the labor force minus the people who are employed by the labor force. Clear? This is unemployment rate from here. If labor force is employed plus unemployed, unemployed is labor force minus employed. So labor force minus employed by labor force is the people who are unemployed. This is nothing but L by L minus E by L. This is nothing but 1 minus E by L. This is the unemployment rate. Now, when it says that un you know, when it says that employment has increased, this means this is increasing. So, for example, if people who were employed are were 100, labor force was 150, maybe now people who are employed has, have become 120. What will be the employment rate E by L earlier? 100 by 150, which will be 2 by 3. What will be employment rate now? 120 by 150, which will be 3 by 4. What is the unemployment rate earlier? 1 minus 2 by 3. 1 by 3, 0 0.33. What is the unemployment rate now? 1 minus 3 by 4, 1 by 4, 0 0.25. So from here, you will think that the right answer is that the unemployment rate in the country will decrease and actually will always decrease. Okay, But when it says that the number of employed worker have increased, when I solved this question, I assumed in the background that the labor force is constant. It just tells me that my population is constant. That my population is constant. 
but it can be the case right that from the same population more people have joined the labor force more people so if more people join the labor force if population out of the same population labor force increases and out of labor force decreases then i will not be sure so take the same example suppose when people who were employed increased from 100 to 120 in the background people who were in the labor force also increased from 150 to 200 then then the employment rate will be 120 by 200 which will be 0 0.6 and unemployment rate will be 1 minus 0 0.6 which will be 0 0.4 so unemployment rate increases from 0 0.33 to 0 0.04 so, because the cushion does not talk anything about what happened to the labor force, it says population is constant. That is very well. It is correct. My population was of 1,000 people. My population is still of 1,000 people. Out of population, few people were in the labor force and some were out of the labor force. So, earlier, 800 people were in the labor force. Few were working. Few were not having jobs. Here also few were employed, few did not have job. But it says this has increased as I go from here to here. Okay, this is correct. But what happened to the labor force? Did more people join the labor force? Did less people join the labor force? What happened to the labor force is not given in the question. And hence I cannot comment on the unemployment rate. Unemployment rate is you know, unemployment rate is number of people unemployed by the labor force, which may have decreased, may have increased, may have remained unchanged. We are not sure. So we cannot answer this question unless information about labor force is given. So it may increase or it may decrease depending on what happens to the labor force in the background solely just changing the number of people employed cannot affect the unemployment rate in one direction it can affect it in any direction okay thank you